This is an example table of contents in MemoryPress. In order to edit your table of contents, all you need to do is scroll over the contents, click there, or come up here to the right side and click Edit Table of Contents. I went ahead and did that. Um, you can see there's a tutorial how this works. I can drag a new chapter in from the right. I'm going to go ahead and drag a new chapter in. And you can see a little blue indicator shows up. And it, I can drop the chapter anywhere, this new chapter, anywhere I want. I can drop it pretty much anywhere in the whole book. But I'm going to go ahead and drop it right here above Memories with Jenny. I want to rename my chapter. So you click on it once. It highlights. And you can, um, I am editing this chapter. Click Enter, and it saves it. Then if I want to move other things around, let's say I want to move Jenny's story, it moves the entire thing, and I'm going to move it down below Nate's story. And you can see it just moves it. Now, for example, if I want to trash something, you can just grab any chapter or any section and drag it down to the trash, and the trash will be highlighted in yellow when it's ready to drop. You can drop it in the trash when it highlights, and you can see it disappeared away from uh, out of the table of contents. Then when I'm done, you go up here to the right, and you can click Save or Cancel. I'm going to go ahead and click Save. Now what's happening is it's saving your table of contents. I just actually reorganized about 20 pages at the beginning of a 50-page book. Currently, it's retypesetting the entire book, all 50 pages, and you're going to see that Jenny's story will be moved below Nate's story. And one of the most difficult parts about making a book is the page numbers. The page numbers in the table of contents, it's hard to keep your book organized and keep things straight. If you've ever used a word processor or anything similar to a word processor, photo book application or book making application, you'll find that one of the most difficult parts is keeping your book organized and keeping the page numbers in the table of contents correct. So you're going to see here, it's retype setting the entire book, and in just a second it will be done, and everything's taken care of automatically. The headers, the footers, um, the entire book. So it takes absolutely no extra work for you. And it will type set for just a second longer. And there you go. That's how easy it is to edit your table of contents in MemoryPress.